So now you probably at this point have the big picture of career scribe. You understand the importance of profiling yourself, having those moments in time that really create the value uh, and substantiate the value in your experience. But you're sitting here staring at this profile page saying, where do I start? Well, let me walk you through a couple of the key components and get you started. So let's get started here. Up in the left-hand corner, you have that opportunity to edit your user information. Make sure it's right, your location, if you want to change a password. Put a picture in if you like. Uh, it only has to be visible if you want it to. My ideal job, pretty self-explanatory. Enter those parameters that you think are important, what you're looking for. And the importance there is select the flexibility options. Do you have some flexibility, no flexibility? Pretty simple. Down into the dimensional items, the job preferences. Have some fun editing those, slide the bar back and forth, um, you know, depending on what type of person you are. As we head down the middle of the page, about me. Well, not too complicated there. Take some time, write a paragraph or two about yourself. The career tracker. Probably one of the most important things on the profile. This is your virtual portfolio. This is the opportunity for you to document those important events, those milestones, the big project that you delivered, and attach those documents, be it a PowerPoint or a Word document, Excel, whatever form they come in, upload that document to support that event, and it'll always be there for you. The documents that you attach to your career tracker events can be shared with anyone you choose at a later date. Developing that portfolio of your career is really what will substantiate the value that you bring to the table. Privacy settings. This is your ability to control who sees your information. You can upload a resume. View my resume. Pretty simple there. Upload your resume. Your video introduction. This is your opportunity to make your best first impression. Simply answer the question, what are the three things most important to you right now in your career? There are video tips if you need them. You can find those on the dashboard. Below the video introduction is your chance to enter more details about your work experience. This isn't just simply restating your resume, but it's giving the kind of details to understand the demographics of the type of companies you've worked for. Education, pretty self-explanatory, right? But don't forget to enter those activities and awards that make you stand out. All right, so there you have it. Very high-level perspective on what to do and how to profile yourself in CareerScribe. Good luck in getting started, and we hope you have a great experience.